Prep your doomsday bunkers, the universe is dying. Okay, maybe that's a little strong. The leader of the Galaxy and Mass Assembly Project said, the universe has basically sat down on a sofa, pulled up a blanket, and is about to nod off for an internal doze. Sounds kind of like the average Sunday to me. Scientists have speculated since the 90s that the universe has been in decline. This latest project between dozens of universities is just further confirmation of that. The researchers measured the energy being emitted from more than 200,000 galaxies. They measured at 21 different wavelengths, between ultraviolet and the far infrared. Theoretically, the Big Bang created all the energy in the universe, some of which became mass. Thanks to Einstein and his equation E equals mc squared, we know stars shine by transferring that mass back into energy. The stars have already lost half their brightness, not just in terms of visible light, but in all the 21 wavelengths measured. A member of the research team told NPR, once you've burned up all that fuel in the universe, essentially, that's it. The stars die like a fire dies, and then you have embers left over that glow, but eventually cool down, and the fire just goes out. But there is some good in the news. The project is one of many advancing our ability to detect energy. Similar to how human history can only go as far back as the stories available, the universe's past is only as deep as the earliest energy we can measure. The researchers are planning on building the world's largest radio telescope over the next 10 years to map the complete history of the universe. And one more piece of good news, the researchers say the universe has a few billion years left to live. That's plenty of time for us to figure out our next move, right? For Newsy, I'm Ryan Beek.